Hey guys, it's Sideasia. I'm back with another video. Today I'm going to show you guys how I got this ombre honey blonde color. So I will be using two bundles in a closure of the 10 inch deep wave hair from the company All of Hair. To color these bundles, I'm going to be using 40 volume developer and 30 volume developer. Um, I'm going to be using a BW2 bleach powder. I mix these in two separate bowls, um, one with 40 volume developer, one with 30 volume developer because for the top I use the 40 and for the like the back of the wig I use 30 volume developer because I wanted it to be lighter on top and darker in the back I guess that's the best way to explain it but anyway so I just mix those together in two separate bowls. So for the top of the wig, I went in with the 40 volume developer and I wanted to start at the top first with the 40 because I knew that it was going to strip the color faster and the top would then be lighter and that's the look I was going for. So when doing this, there's really no right or wrong way to do it. You just put the bleach in the hair and just put it wherever you want the hair to bleach. Um, yeah, I do like to use aluminum foil after I put the bleach in it because I feel like it makes the process go faster. So once I get towards the middle of the head, that's when I start using a 30 volume developer which is the lighter one so i was going for more of a i guess a brown i don't know the hair did get lighter than i thought it would but i wasn't trying to make it as blonde as the top So once I get to the back of the head, that's when I start putting the bleach mixture just on the tips of the hair because I did want the top to stay black. And yeah, that's pretty much it. After this, I just let the bleach sit in the hair for about 15 minutes because it definitely was changing. The top was definitely getting blonde and it got way lighter than I really wanted it to, but it still came out fine. I still really liked it. So now you guys are about to see that I did not tone this hair with any toner. I just took my purple shimmer light shampoo and I washed the bleach out. I let the purple shampoo sit in the hair for about 15 minutes and that was how I toned the hair. So now I'm just applying the wig. Um, I didn't really go into detail about how I did it because this isn't the video that I wanted to talk about that on um I do have a strap on the wig that I sewed on to it um an elastic band but when I'm putting this on you know I just use a regular got to be glue
so i did not pluck this wig and i kind of should have not in the parting but just where the baby hairs are because the baby hairs were extremely thick but i also whenever i do my baby hair and i pluck i never really do it on my head i was just doing that for the video so i'll never do that again because yeah the baby hairs were so thick and i hate thick baby hair because it just looks fake and wiggish but for the video i didn't even fix it i just ran out the house because i had to go somewhere really quick i was already an hour behind but yeah yeah i did not like the baby hair at all it just looks so fake to me i hate that look but um in another video i will definitely show you guys how i do my baby hair normally and i'm gonna fix this i'll never wear it like that again <laughs> So now I'm just taking the spray bottle and spraying all throughout the hair to get it wet. Um, I do like that wet look so afterwards I took some curl cream and I just put that throughout the hair to moisturize it a little bit and get the curls back. Um, that's pretty much all I did to the hair. Uh, like I said I didn't really pluck the part. The part doesn't need any plucking. Um, really just the baby hair because the baby hair is just entirely too thick for me and I don't like that. But like I said, don't care because I flipped the hair over it so you couldn't really tell when I did my side part. So now I'm just taking my hot curling wand just to get it flat at the top, which literally everybody does. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and if you guys have any suggestions or any other videos that you would like me to post, then leave it in the comments. Thank you.